Hi, Clint Brown here. I'm going to show you how to use the move dimension command inside of the Inventor drawing environment. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to just zoom in on this area of the drawing over here. And what you'll see is this 35 millimeter dimension on the left hand side. So what I can do is I can right click on the dimension and I can choose move dimension. I'm then able to select the view that I want to move it to and then I can simply tweak its position. One more time, right click, move dimension, select the new view, tweak its position. Really useful. So what about another use case? What I want to do is place a dimension to give me the maximum width of the bottom of this component. So if I choose this line over here, I come across, you see that I get a dimension of 16.98. Now I know that that's not correct. The actual dimension is 17. So what I can do is I can place the dimension on this bottom view and then move it up to the top. So let's have a look at what that looks like. Place my dimension, so from that back line over there, and I want to come up to the edge of the component, and you'll see that that dimension is 17 millimeters. So all I need to do is delete the 16.98, and it's as simple as right clicking and saying move dimension, choosing my new view, and then positioning the 17 where I need it. You'll see that that's going in perfectly tangent to that curve. So there you have it. Move dimension in the inventor drawing environment. I hope you found this tip useful.